Hello everybody and big hello to my Twin Flame community and all of my Twin Flame friends. This is a Twin Flame private client reading. If you require a personal reading for your own Twin Flame journey, kindly contact me by putting a comment below this YouTube video or by contacting me through Facebook Messenger if you are a part of my Facebook groups. So uh, folks, this is a reading for my clients Joe and Jane and um, they are both uh, uh, they have requested this reading and I'm going to read for both of them. So, um, Joe, without uh, further delay, I'm going to read for Joe and Jane right now. Um, so, uh, Joe, what I'm getting for you, my dear, is that uh, you have felt <coughs> you have felt a lot of heartbreak you have felt a lot of disappointment and your heart is totally shattered at, at this point when you reached uh, towards me for uh, reading, you know. You have been going through this heartbreak and this disappointment from a fairly long time now and it's, it's like nothing in the world makes sense to you right now because the heart is such a space that the, that the heart relates us to our outer world and to whatever is uh, being felt by us and right now your heart is at a totally disappointing, totally heartbreaking, uh, you have heart wrenching pain you know in your emotional body and um, it's devastating for you you know. Uh, I'm feeling your emotions right now and um, it's really terrible for me you know to feel this, to feel this kind of uh, purging energy from your heart to feel this kind of disappointment, to feel this kind of, you know, that somebody has stabbed you with a knife in your heart, you know, somebody has betrayed you, somebody has stabbed you, somebody has not cared for how your heart emotions or your feelings go, it's terrible. This is what I'm getting right now that you're feeling and my friend, you uh, as a personality, as a personality, you are this this woman who is very abundant in her thinking, who's very, who has very uh, luxurious thoughts, you know, who, who is not a very petty minded woman, you know, or a very uh, penny pinching kind of a woman. She's a very abundant woman and also I'm being shown that you have children. I don't know if you mentioned this to me or not, I don't know, but you have children of your own or, or if you don't have children of your own, uh, currently, you are a very motherly, uh, a motherly person, you know, in a way that you have a lot to give, you know, um, you have a lot to give, you, your emotions are very like, you know, you, you are a caretaker kind of a personality, your emotions are very towards other people, you know, you would, you would give anything away for love, you know, you are that kind of a person, my friend, um, you also like to give a lot of comfort and safety to people who are dependent on you, you know, you never leave anybody uh, in the middle of any problem, you know, you are such a person who will always stand by somebody, will always help somebody, will always nurture somebody, will always help them grow, you know, you're this kind of person as, and right now you're going through a lot of, lot of uh, pain and lot of heartbreak, you know, uh, nothing makes sense and you are, you are in this limbo period, you are in this limbo period or this waiting period is what I'm being shown, you are in this waiting period or limbo period and um, like somebody, uh, somebody uh, whom you love, which is your twin, you know, is, is, uh, is conflicted, he's very conflicted in his thought, one time he wants to come forward and one time he wants to move backwards, you know, so he's very conflicted in his thought and that is the that is the issue which is leading to this heartbreak and this disappointment and it has been happening from a while now, you know. Um, so while these things were happening, you know, you met this person, you know, when you uh, were into a committed thing with him and in the beginning, this person who is your twin, you know, I confirm that and as the reading goes by, you'll get more confirmations. So when you met this person, you know, you were you were in, in the right state of mind and he was probably in the right state of mind too, you know. Uh, he, he kind of gave you a lot of comfort, he gave you a lot of support at that time initially when you met, you know, and it led to an engagement. Uh, he gave you a lot of support, a lot of com 
comfort he he came forward as the person like he would he would take you out of troubled waters you know now troubled waters are mean like general day to day problems he he showed that uh, uh, feeling towards you he showed you that if any time there's a problem in your life he will be there you know um and he you guys had a very harmonious connection which is what i'm being shown you guys had a very balanced connection a very harmonious connection initially when you met and everything seemed like you know it was making sense you know the larger picture the bigger picture was making sense you felt like you know whatever you wanted in the world you have received in the form of this person through the universe you know everything felt very glorious everything felt very you felt very light headed you know you felt very light headed very giddy very happy you know which is what i'm being shown my attention is being taken towards the head and the and the crown chakra it felt very light headed you know when you were with him uh, light headedness is a good sign it means like when you are in love you feel very light headed you know there's no tension in your brain so everything feels very very dreamy you know so that is how you felt when you initially met him you know and this person who was uh, probably like uh, i'm being shown that he's a, a younger energy than you now he could be younger in years also or he could just be a younger energy uh, and you can validate this but i'm being shown that he is a younger energy in years also and in otherwise also in his maturity so this person um you know, this twin of yours he is a younger energy person a, a slightly immature person than you and he uh, at this at the time when you met you know he was also dabbling in some financial ideas or he was opening up some financial venture or he was entering a new job or something like that or he had a new financial idea which he was sharing with you or something like that but in general he was a younger energy even younger in years and he had a lot of prosperity towards him that he made you feel like everything is everything is uh, hunky dory everything is like the um, you know i'm being shown like green grass and trees i'm being shown green grass and trees it felt like with him it felt like everything was uh, uh, you know it uh, with him everything felt like very green you know like green pastures green pastures are what i'm being shown you know it felt like green pastures it felt like a lot of abundance a lot of uh, greenery you know so the relationship was very healthy and growing you know and he, this person was ready to put in a lot of effort also initially for you he was putting in a lot of effort and he was doing his his bit and part you know um, he was leading to some growth in you and everything was uh, conducive everything was working uh, working forward you know and and suddenly suddenly you know something changed you know something changed and uh, there was like this feeling of you know just giving up on him and there was this feeling that you had that you know everything is lost you know you just wanted to like you were so disillusioned with the with things the way things change you know the way his behavior changed that it left you with a lot of confusion you could not make sense that why this thing is happening everything from green pastures now i'm being shown a gray a gray sky you know from green pastures everything turned into a gray sky you know and and you you could not contemplate whether you should leave now whether you should move on you know there were thoughts in your mind that you just wanted to leave the whole situation and you just wanted to move on you know because there was so much disillusionment i'm also seeing there were a lot of lies involved a lot of deceit involved like he would say something and then do something else you know uh, there was a lot of lies involved lot of deceit like you know small i'm not being shown big lies small lies small lies which you speak that oh i was at the grocery store but actually i was at the gym you know small lies he used to tell you small lies and you you kind of caught those lies he he uh this is what i'm being shown that there were small lies and deceit involved which further aggravated you and uh, you know it was like a tug of war all the time like all the time whenever you even communicated you know there were always bickerings happening there were always bickerings happening and uh, small fights you know small lies and stuff like that and he had the, he he kind of like you know he was at a point where he was trying to uh uh probably he was doing this because he was totally not interested in uh, progressing forward with this journey uh in his in his 3d body or in his uh, um in his human body you know but his soul did uh, his soul actually knew that he was your twin but his uh, but his human body did not want to uh was pulling him back was pulling him back and why the reason that i'm being shown is that he had some certain financial things he had this idea in his mind that he wanted to do something with his finances first 
and he was trying to get some buyers or he was trying to get some merchants to agree to something financial that he wanted to open like you know he wanted to crack a business deal first you know that was kind of the obstacle but he he did not know that you know uh he did not know the bigger picture you know he always acted in a very immature way and he was a immature energy you know so he probably like was in this uh, this dilemma that uh, you know he wanted to uh do something financially first time again being shown like a financial venture and he was he had some financial ideas he might have spoken about them to you but at the back of his mind he he was this immature energy which thought like you know generally how men think at a particular age that i have to establish this and that that and then i can like you know and you were a wiser you know nurturing giving energy and he could not he just could not handle that energy and he he was this and and, and then you were taking the initiative all the time you were fixing time and dates with him and you know he he is not the person let me tell you one thing you know which is very important in your case he is not the person you can pull into something there are there are some guys who have weak energy and you can pull them into something and make them do something you know whether they are doing it with love or whether they are doing it with irritation they still do it but this guy is not like that the more you initiate stuff with him the more he is going to pull back you know so your part in this journey is not to initiate any stuff and when you give him room to room to grow room for his soul to grow he is going to grow and he is going to approach you my friend so you do not need to worry you can just keep sitting on your ass for all you know and i'm going to show you your inner work you know later in the reading and you can just focus on that inner work keep sitting on your ass and this guy will come back because the twin always comes back as i tell everybody you know so my friend all this that has happened in the past and the present which i described which was a very dismal and despair filled stuff you know my friend everything is going to change and you will be amazed at how everything changes for you okay so i'm going to describe how the changes are going to come through you know so my friend this person who is right now a immature energy wants you wants you let him off the hook let him off the hook now it's time you know let him off of the hook once you let him off the hook the universe will present him with lessons in your absence and in your non communication with him in your absence you know he will realize your worth you know that is the only way he is going to realize your worth my friend in your personal twin journey i am telling you with a disclaimer if you do not follow this message your reading is not going to your life is not going to go according to this reading you know so you need to you need to give him a room to grow you need to uh, have a lot of non communicative time you need to focus on your own inner work for him to grow you know because he is going to grow on his own path so my friend when you do this you know he is going to start growing too you know in your absence you know he is going to start going to there's already physical distance but there is no energetic separation between you because you are always in his energy you know so you have to create a energetic separation for him to realize stuff and for him to spiritually grow there will be a lot of spiritual transformation in him my friend and you will obtain the family life and the love that you yearn to obtain with him you will also have pregnancies and kids together i'm seeing two pregnancies they could be baby girls i'm also being shown one baby boy it could be one baby girl and one baby boy or it could be two baby girls you will get that family with him because when his spiritual maturation happens the twin will get attracted back to you in your physical life and that is when you will have the pregnancies together there is a lot of hope in this situation my friend lot of hope which you do not see right now everything is happening behind the curtains but i can see that there's a lot of hope in this situation your wishes are going to be fulfilled like anything my friend like anything like anything you are the the abundant female that you were that i described in the beginning of this reading the abundant nurturing giving woman that you were you know now is going to come the time to receive all that abundance from the universe till now you have just given 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 my friend you have just given 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 you have nurtured your children possibly if you have them you have nurtured that this guy you have nurtured every person that ever came into your life but the the universe is going to take heed of that and ultimately with the this man spiritually maturing you are first of all going to get a happy family with him with kids and pregnancies a lot of hope in your relationship you know you are going to have all wishes fulfilled and you are going to receive from the universe and become this abundant female and your 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 scenario is going to be that of a receptive state receiving from the universe rather than giving you know so uh, the wheels are going to turn my friend the tables are going to turn and that 
female who always gave others stuff is going to finally receive stuff and then my friend I get confirmation that both of you are twin flames and the universe is going to play a judgmental role in this journey and finally you are going to come together as the lovers as the loving couple and it's going to lead to a victory I'm also being shown you might have a processional wedding a church wedding where you will invite the community and all the family members that you know it's going to be a processional marriage it's not going to be a you know where you sign papers and you get married or you just do a small ceremony it's going to be a big processional wedding my friend congratulations you are uh, you at that point when, when all this uh, will be happening all these positive changes will be happening in your life you will you will you will feel very abundant you will feel very emotional you will feel like you know oh my god how did this all happen at one point all this was seeming like it's too far it's too far fetched and how how is this even gonna come true but my friend it will come true like anything and you will be so emotional at that point you will be so emotional and also you will have those pregnancies at that time or will at least be dreaming of those spirit babies he will be very romantic towards you he will be courting you dating you at that time and you will feel you will feel my friend like you can get anything in the world at that point you will feel like you can create anything in your life at that point because that relationship that twin journey when the union has happens when the marriage happens when the kids happen they will give you so much strength that you will feel that you can accomplish anything in this world my friend and that is when also you will have a lot of spiritual epiphany spiritual awakenings you know happening because you will trust in the universe so much because you will be provided with so much you will start believing start trusting in the universe so much which you even do now you know but at that time it will be a totally different scenario your frequency your vibration will be top notch you know you will believe in esoteric powers in the universe in god so much the whole world will be in your hands it will be like the whole world is in your hands and at that time my friend you will uh, you will have no disillusionment you will have no fears you will have no uh, holding back you know that you have been doing till now and also you will uh, he will also that that financial idea that he had in mind at that time he will have launched it and he will he will be more satisfied with his financial ventures also and then after all this happening my friend you will still keep releasing the attachment to the outcomes you will still keep releasing the attachment to how this twin journey should be going you will start going more with the flow and you will start trusting the process more and at that time again my friend the world will be at your feet the world will be at your feet you can get anything that you desire in the world if you put the right intentions to the universe you will also become very intuitive at that time and my friend you will set up a very beautiful family home with him you know again more spiritual transformations will happen in both of you you will shed old beliefs patterns while you will be living together as a married couple you will keep shedding old beliefs patterns and old ways of living you know both of you will keep transforming uh, spiritually while you're together in the union and you will come to a point where both of you will be a clean slate both of you will be a clean slate regarding the matters which uh, disturb both of you regarding each other and also regarding ex partners you know both of you will be a clean slate and this man who is so holding back right now this man this twin who is so holding back right now jane who is holding back so much right now and is not opening up his mouth and not reassuring and validating you of his love my friend this person will decide once and for all that no i have to give my all to this journey i have to give my all to this marriage and that is when the actual physical marriage he will give you a marriage proposal and the physical marriage will take place all the so congratulations my friend all the time that he's been in dole drums regarding whether he should come forward this man will finally make a very clean cut decision with his own analytical abilities he will reminisce over that decision for a while and then he will come forward with a marriage proposal all this time that this man has been behaving like you know he didn't does not know what to do he's always in a limbo state he's always like not trying to move forward he's always like stuck there you know sitting on on his as all the time this man and also this man who has like you know he also has poverty consciousness he feels like he does not deserve you he feels like you're so so accomplished so much better you're just such a fine woman you know this man will finally muster up the courage to present you with a marriage proposal and then my friend will begin your new beginning in love that new beginning which will be so much different he will come forward as a new man with all his spiritual transformations all the irritations that you feel 
for him that he says something, does something, and he's not like manning up, you know. He's not man enough, you know, uh, the way he behaves. All that will change, my friend. It will be a new beginning in love, you know, a new beginning which will be filled of so much romance. The cup will be so full that he will just... Uh, I'm being shown that he will not leave you, you know, there will be so much physical intimacy, so much sexual beauty that he will just always want to be with you and also will give you so much romance and emotional love and my friend out of that will rely, will will be born a baby boy again I'm being shown, I, I was also shown a baby girl, I'm shown two children, two spirit children but again I'm shown a baby boy, so this person who, who behaved in a very irrational, immature way will finally realize his worth, you know, and he will become this very mature person who will present you with love, with spiritual power, and with, with, very, with very much mental clarity also regarding his own finances in his own life. And my friend, the sleepless nights that you've been having, the sleepless nights, and also the, the days that you've ha been having where other romantic opportunities were presented to you, and you decided not to take them, you know, because you wanted to go ahead with this twin journey because you felt a certain connection, you felt that you were chosen for this journey and you felt that there was some spiritual connection with Jane. Those things my friend are going to come true because you are going to be given by the universe this marriage, this engagement, you know, this lifelong journey with this man, you know, and also children. And all of the efforts, my friend, you've been putting so much effort into this journey. All of the efforts that you've been putting into this journey, my friend, are going to come true. You know, all of the efforts that you've put till now will not go in vain. All of the inner work that you've done, all of the all of the pains and all of the depression that you've gone through is going to be is going to not go in vain and you are going to be granted uh, granted this marriage with this man and a lifetime relationship with children with this man most definitely and this time that has it has felt that he is always in doldrums and your life is always in a limbo and your life is always stuck and you know there are always two decisions you know you do not know, even know right now it's so crazy that you do not even know right now whether you are with this person whether the relationship is positive or whether it's a breakup you know you do not even know that right now it's so bad you know and you feel like you've been defeated, like you don't see a way out, you know. You feel like all of your hopes have gone flat to the ground, you know. This is how you feel, but my friend, but my friend, but my friend, there's going to be a lot of progress in the coming future. A lot of progress and so fast, you know, it's going to happen so fast. Once he reaches that spiritual maturity, you'll be amazed. You'll be amazed if Jane is the same guy that he is now. He's going to improve so fast. The improvements are going to take place so fast for both of you. And ultimately, all that you desire in life, a happy home with him, a marriage with him, kids with him, good finances with him, like an ideal situation, an ideal marriage is going to happen for you. And this guy is going to be yours forever. And he is going to not wait to come back from work and get with you, you know, get together with you. So my friend, I'm going to show you the cards of the deck before I proceed to your inner work. Disappointment that you feel, the queen that you are, doldrums, you met this person in the past, he promised to take you out of troubled waters, the relationship was very harmonious initially. This person had some financial ideas which is why he did not go forward with the twin journey like you wanted. He did play a good role in the beginning initially, he did work for the relationship. Then you felt everything was lost and you just wanted to move on. He was also doing small lies and deceit. There were many bickerings between both of you. He was again struggling with some financial venture where he was trying to crack a business deal or some job or something of the nature. But my friend, he is going to spiritually mature, become the king of vans. He, this guy is going to reach spiritual maturity when that happens. You are going to get a happy family, wish fulfillment, happy family, kids, couple, lot of hope in this situation, star, wish fulfillment. You are going to receive and become the abundant female, confirmation of twin flames, this is why all this is happening. The universe is going to play a judgmental role in waking you up and making you spiritually mature. Twin flame confirmation, lovers, both of you are going to come together as lovers in the end. It's going to be a processional marriage, my friend, a processional church marriage. You are going to feel so emotional at that time. Also, spirit babies are going to come into the picture, either in dreams or in real pregnancies. You're going to feel you can achieve anything in the world, my friend. 
you are also going to go through different epiphanies and spiritual transformations. You will feel you have the world in your hands. All this trauma and this pain of the past will finally go away. He will also mature financially and materialistically in his job or in his, in his business. You will let go of the ideas of how he should behave or how this twin journey will be. And at that point, you will get the world at your feet, my friend. You will also use your intuition a lot, my friend. You will use your intuition a lot. And you will get this happy home with him. There will again be a lot of spiritual transformation which will happen for both of you. Releasing old patterns and you will come to a clean state. A clean slate, you know, a clean state. Ground zero. This man who is holding back so much right now. You see these coins. This person is holding back the coins. This person who is holding back, back so much emotionally right now is going to finally reminisce about the decision, you know, he's going, going to finally make a choice and present you with a marriage proposal. This is the card of a marriage proposal, a proposal coming your way. And this man who has always hanged from the tree, not making a decision, always like in his thought process and not doing anything to move forward. And this man who has thought that he does not deserve a woman, a fine woman like you, is going to present you with a new love and he is going to come out as a new man and you are going to get this really emotional sexual love with him also a baby boy is going to be born out of it this person is also going to gain a lot of mental clarity by that time he is going to become a very emotional man he is going to date you you know he is going to uh, he is going to present you with a lot of emotional maturity and love you see this this dinosaur this water dinosaur this is old school dating you know he's going to quote you and everything these sleepless nights that you've had, my friend, are going to go away. You're not taking other romantic opportunities that might have come your way is a very courageous step that you made because finally the universe is going to grant to you. You see this person giving the other person money. This means, and, and he has the scales in his hand, you know, you see the scales. So the universe is going to grant to you, my friend, no, your effort, all the efforts that you've made are not going to go to waste, my friend. All of these depressed nights and the time that you spent indoors feeling so bad is not going to go to waste. This, this journey which has been filled with this craziness where you could not even know whether you are on with this relationship or off or it's a breakup. All that pain, all that despair, all that depression and falling flat on the ground is going to go away my friend because you are going to receive this rapid growth, this rapid growth and this person of yours coming rushing forward coming rushing forward, he won't, he won't even wait to get home from work, you know, he'll have so much love for you, such rapid growth, and finally, he will present you with a happy home, pets, you know, grandparents, uh, grandchildren, everything is going to happen with this person, this is a person of a lifetime, my friend, now I'm going to go to the second deck uh, for you, my friend, what I'm getting uh, for you, Joe and Jane, is that, you need to, uh, I'm being shown that you need to, uh, first of all, free yourself from the patterns, from the beliefs and from the uh, from the figments of your mind that you keep imagining that things should be a certain way, a relationship is good if the person is texting me 100 times a day, a relationship is good if the person is Skyping me once a week, you know, if he's not, probably he's with another woman, this is all bullshit. Nobody has the time to connect with any person, you know, who is not up to their par, first of all, you know, no man or woman. We do see cheating cases and other stuff happening all around, but that doesn't mean that we should pollute our minds, you know. Always give the other person a benefit of doubt because love is all there is, you know. Love is the only answer. If you keep, keep doubting the other person, if you keep doing all these things, you're just defeating your own purpose, you know. Let's say if a person doesn't doesn't uh, come out to be true in the end, it's their loss. It's their loss. It's not your loss, you know. So free yourself of all the negative patterns that, you know, things should move a certain way. Uh, if my father doesn't call me, you know, once in a month, he's not a good father. He might have his own trials and tribulations. Give everybody a chance, you know. So free yourself, you know. This is not just for you, Joe. It's also for uh, Jane, you know, that he needs to free himself of all his immature ways that he's been dealing uh, with you till now. And all those immature ways are also a part of this twin journey, Joe, because because of him behaving this way, you have a lot of wounds in you. 
because of him behaving this way you have a lot of wounds in you and if he had not given you these wounds you would not be here with me today and you would also not think of doing any of your inner work or healing or clearing your body your emotional body your spiritual body if it not, was not for jane so we need to give jane some credit <laughs> so you know also my friend i mean told you need to trust the process you need to trust this twin journey you are on this twin journey jo and jane you are twin flames so and you have called in your uh, you have called in a pure love a soul connected love from the universe a long time back and you have been given this journey this is a twin flame journey that is why all this shit is happening right now and it will move into positivity very soon you know twin flames go through a lot of shit initially and after they come together the shit decreases and finally like in some time the shit totally disappears whereas in soulmate relationship or codependent relationships they are very good in the beginning the re- those relationships are very good in the beginning but then everything falls apart you know so it's better to have all the shit beforehand and then go into a very luxurious period you know so i mean told that you need to trust this journey you also called in this twin journey and it was granted to you because you were calling into the universe to give you a very soul connected a partner who really gets you i am also being shown that children involved in this journey you already have children or also you are going to have new pregnancies and new spirit babies coming into your dreams or they already are coming into your dreams i am also being shown jo that you need to take the curtain out of your face you need to take this veil out of your face and you need to see life for what it is you need to also see the twin journey for what it is you cannot control this twin journey you cannot control the other twin like a puppet too if you want to skype him once a week and he is not doing that you cannot control that you have to give him space you have to give him time you have to let this twin flame journey prosper on its own so you need to lift this veil out of your face and you need to face how things are right now you need to embrace and you need to accept things as they are right now for things to shift you know for the energy to shift if if you keep holding on to this energy that he is not doing this he is not doing this i want this i want this you will always remain in a state of lack and wanting this it will never come true because if you don't shift your energies from wanting and his lack his presence will never come around you you have to always feel you already are connected spiritually you might be feeling him in dreams and you might be able to talk to him telepathically use that you are always connected there's no energetic separation between twins you know so use that to your advantage so that you feel that he's always there when you start feeling that he's always there your frequency and vibration will shift shift so much that he will become your reality his presence will become your reality my friend use those uh principles that i'm telling you i'm also being shown again that there were some financial issues between both of you either he was trying to launch something or you were trying to launch something and there was a issue of finances between both of you which might have come up in the journey you know or come as a obstacle in the journey which will be, be be worked out as it was shown in the first part that he will work on his finances and career and ultimately he will become a prosperous person you know once the union happens and around the time of the union i'm also being shown that right now you have like very codependent traits you are very dependent on each other you know uh, emotionally spiritually mentally whenever you're together you just want to stick to each other like bubble gum you know now that's that's okay emotionally and in terms of emotional love but if you if two you have to be bubble gums of two different flavor let's say one is cherry and the other is pineapple you know so both the bubble gums can be eaten at two different times you know and they are no not not like both the bubble gums are pineapple flavor that you can just like you know both of them should have their own worth first of all one should be cherry the other should be pineapple so that the whole world can feel that these are two different people who can come together and they can share their traits together with each other to form another third no uh, union you know which is a cherry pineapple mix you know it should not be that both of you are pineapple and you just uh, come together and nobody knows uh, it's a big blob of pineapple i hope you get my uh, example you know so you have to leave this codependency traits and you have to leave uh, this fact that he should behave a certain way if he is behaving like this he is a good boyfriend if he is not he is not a good boyfriend you need to become more interdependent my friend you need to do your inner work you need to become more whole yourself you need to uh, feed your soul you need to heal you need to do some clearing and you need to keep a very open mind regarding what he is doing in his life till he doesn't return back you should not accuse him of anything you should not uh, try to figure out if he is with another woman 
uh, or not you know because he is not and he will not be in in any time you know of this journey because that is not required you know and he is least bit interested so you need to keep a very open mind this is the man who is worth waiting for and he is the one for you my friend he is the man for a lifetime you need to uh, pay attention to whatever i have told you in this reading and just work according to that and everything will come through as i have told in the reading but you need to pay attention to how and how i told you regarding the principles that you need to follow uh, after you do all this my friend you will get a you will you have been engaged to him and you will get another engagement which will be a formal engagement happening between both of you and this person is again confirmed as your twin flame you will after that point when he comes back a new man and the a newer higher level of commitment happens in the form of an engagement you will again be given a chance to know each other at a emotional spiritual mental level and this person is your uh, is your true love you need to make the effort you know you need to make the effort on your own body first your own emotional and spiritual body first you need to love yourself more and you need to come out as this new female you know you are stuck in your energies right now you need to come forward as this new female who loves herself and who loves her own personality because when you in when you increase your loving factor when you increase your love factor and you increase your frequency and you see yourself in a new light and a new new vibration a new frequency will arise out of that and out of that my friend out of that this relationship will be given another chance this relationship will be given another chance and it will lead to a wedding my friend it will lead to a wedding congratulations so much and i'm going to show you the cards both of you need to free yourself in different ways this is inner work call me for that you need to trust this journey you had called in for a soul connection you know from the universe and it was granted to you there are children involved in this journey and you need to and also children will be coming in the future spirit babies or pregnancies you know happening you need to forgive a lot of people in your past you need to uh, there have been some issues with your parents your family you know uh, or distant relatives close relatives friends that you need to forgive you need to take sessions on forgiveness healings and clearings contact me for that you also need to lift your veil my friend you need to lift your veil off your face and you need to embrace and accept the reality of this twin flame journey as it is right now only then the energy will shift for it to for it to go into the future if you keep holding on to the energies that are right now if you keep complaining and cribbing it will not move forward i am again being shown you have had some issues with your mother and father some child abuse issues or some uh, you have a wounded inner child which is coming in the way or i am also being shown that he might have a wounded inner child or family issues parental issues and also like forgiving and learning issues these two are your major issues you know and also that you need to also that you need to free yourself from from past patterns but these parental issues this these wounded inner child and that you are carrying and also forgiving you are stuck with some past energies that you need to release also i'm being shown that financial finances and career were a obstacle on this journey in some way i'm also being shown that you need codependency in your work my friend to become this whole interdependent person and then merge together the final spiritual merge will happen all this is in your work you have to contact me for that if you wish to you also need to stop any accusation or anything that is happening regarding another female being present while he is not responding because there's none this man is worth waiting for you have to wait this twin journey out you will receive everything i told you in the first reading everything is going to come true all the wishes are going to be granted the universe is at your side it is going to play a judgment call for both of you this person is the one for you this is the one he is going to come up with a formal engagement again once he returns back this person is again a confirmed twin flame you will after the after he comes back you will get a chance to emotionally spiritually mentally know each other or at a better scale because now he will also be ready this man is your true love jane is your true love my friend again i'm being shown spirit babies you know you are going to have pregnancies together and it is going to be once he arrives back it's going to be a totally new love a totally new love like i described before because he is going to be a totally new man that is why the love is going to be totally new you know you have to 
you have to make efforts towards this journey my friend both of you now we cannot control him but we can control you so we need to do this inner work with you so that you can make the efforts towards this journey and then you also have to start seeing yourself you have to start seeing yourself in a new light you have to make yourself so lovable my friend you have to make yourself so lovable that he has no pathway but to return back to you because when you make yourself so lovable and it increases your frequency or your vibration anything that you have wished for in life is going to be attracted towards your energetic body my friend that is the principle you you have to see yourself in a new light my friend you have to create a new loving body for yourself you have to let go of all the self esteem self worth and self uh, you know a fitting attitude towards you that you know this is how a man is behaving with you this is not how the man is behaving with you the universe is making him behave this way so that your wounds come into light and you do all your inner work you know and you actually energetically separate from this man during the period and you do inner work so that he can be connected back to your energetic body full and final in a very new manly way and you are also a new woman at that time and at the time when you do all this inner work your relationship will receive a fair chance my friend and you will go into a wedding my friend jo and jane i loved reading for you contact me for inner work and congratulations for this wedding which is coming in the near future thank you so much